Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sagar Tejapati and in this video, I am going to teach you one of the important question of PySpark which I have gotten from the LinkedIn. So I thought to uh, make a video so that you will uh, you will understand the concept and it's very important concept actually. Right. So it's a null save join concept. So before going to that, I would like to introduce my course that is database certified data engineering geo to hero if you are interested to buy this course or to enroll into this course you can click on buy button and you can you can you can learn this database end to end thing there there is around 21 hours of content so you can just go one by one and understand it i will give the link in the description box now let's come back to the question so the question saying that we are giving two data frames you can understand we have df1 and we have df2 right now if you see this is the uh, uh, like this is the data correct so we have id name and we have id value now we need to join these two uh, you know two data frame right so in a simple way you know uh, here we wantedly you know added here null values okay null values we wantedly here added now what if if i write here df1 dot join df2 dot uh, comma df1 dot id is equal to df2 dot id right and let's say if i put here left then df dot show now you will see we will uh, we have gotten here like null uh, 2 null 4 so how we got this let's try to understand we have used here left join so left join what happens all the values which is present in the left side it will come eventually right so we have like null so we have gotten here null null allies right and we are we are here we have null null but uh, right now we have two so two comes two bob and two y because two is also present here and two values also present here that's why we got on here y now we have null charlie so like we have null and we have charlie right so that's how we got an over here and we have like four david and here we have null null right but we know that you know null <laughs> if we if we join to null it won't work correct now what if if i do the same thing but instead of uh, you know uh, using this i will be using function called equal null save df2 dot id we just use this function now what has happened you can understand null allies null w so what happens it it joins with this it this and this null will uh, this null join with this null and this allies and this w has printed over here in the second row there is a x so what happened this null has joined with this null and given the result like this like like this only we have uh, you know it has been uh, done right so i hope that you understood this concept it's very simple question simple you know function uh, try to understand this in detail you can change it to left to right uh, right to inner uh, right so that you will understand properly and it will be use useful when you have a lot of null value and you do not need to ignore the null value on the you do not need to ignore the combinations right chalo thank you bye bye we'll meet you in the next lecture please keep following this uh, youtube keep following the geek coders portal so that you will get notification whenever i upload a new video thank you bye bye